Hey guys, Hobble Dragon. Alien Isolation. Here we go again. Okay, so last time. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, last time we were gonna go down this rabbit hole. Again, because nothing goes wrong when you go in vents. And too bad I can't wear that. And I don't know how my voice is going to sound. Oh, shiza. I don't know how my voice is going to sound on this recording. Because... Uh, in my head, my voice sounds really off. So. Um... Da -da -da. Oh, that's me. No, that's not me. That's... Something else. I think. Isn't there like a lean button? Just kind of lean a bit. I'm totally expecting, like, you look here and the aliens just staring at you. Totally expecting that, because I would be that that sort of developer. I would uh. Wait, if it just crawled around here, where did... Crap, it was waiting for me, wasn't it? Uh, I'd be that developer that would... Several one in. <sighs> After, like, six of them. Seven of them, just to make it off. I would put it where that alien was sitting there staring at you. And, uh... It would just, you just turn and it'd be right there up your ass, staring at you through that damn vent. It's a little bit like when I first played the original. The original Dead Space. This damn place is falling apart. Falling? It already fell. And it didn't land gently either. It. It hit with a vengeance, yo. Oh. That was convenient. Good cough. Yeah, I walked under a bunch of dust. Uh, good, good cough. <laughs> It's like, if you never played a Dead Space game, it is just like this. It's very, uh, I'm not going to use, I'm not going to use the right word. I'm just going to stop because I'm not using the right word right now. Uh, am, am, am not ambiguous, uh, not ambidextrous, uh, very heavily sound-based, um, Ambient, 
uh, very heavily ambiance is as good as I'm gonna get um, where they rely a lot on noise lens flare lens flare um Yeah, where they rely a lot on the different sounds that things can make. So it's pretty quiet overall. There's a lot of loud spots. I don't want to walk out in that. Damn sure I don't want to walk near that dead body. I have seen things in the Alien series. I don't know. No, no. Um, this is one part where you're near the start where you're investigating. Plasma torch. Can't see crap. Okay. Where you're investigating. You walk into this. It, it was a terminal. You walk into this terminal. Well, technically, it's. Oh, God. So many hosts. Eh. Um. Or former hosts. But it's it's the end of the line part of it where they um like where the trains and everything stop to rest for however long, get maintenance, all that kind of jazz. And it's dead quiet. Except for <laughs> Except for um Ignore the dead bodies. Ignore the dead bodies. Except for uh, be the exit up ahead. I wonder if anybody's actually watching. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Can you see it in my eyes? Hello from the other side of the door. October twenty first. I wonder if this is a quarantine symbol right here because several several things that you play that have like diseases or zombie uh, infections and such fuck the marshals um, have that where it's it's code for uh, like location how many people are inside said sealed location, if it's been checked, if it's been quarantined but not checked, um, if no one has done anything in that area whatsoever, uh, if there's, like, guards posted, and it's supposed to be, like, a coded identifier sort of thing. But the, uh, right, so you walk into that, that end of the line <sighs> terminal. And there's one of the trolleys hanging from its suspension rail, and, uh... Hanging from the suspension rail. Okay, it's just that. And... The, um... What you call it? You walk past it, and it's, you know, it's dangling there, no big deal. And then you get to the end, you look at a vent, and all of a sudden you hear it swinging, and you hear this god-awful breathing, and it's... This loud, like p p panting down the back of your neck, something gross and disgusting, and just like oozing out of places it really should not. It really should not be oozing. What the shit was that? like squealing. You know stuff that squeals like that? 
raptors, xenomorphs, malfunctioning androids. Yep, there is a lot of shit that squeals like that. Five Nights at Freddy's, animatronics, those bitches. Yep. And you just get that feeling at that point in Dead Space where you're like, I don't, I don't want to turn around. Nothing good will come of me turning around. Don't make me turn around. But you can't move forward because it's Samuels. Because it's the end of the line. There's no. There's nothing else. There's ion torch, of course. There's nothing else to do but turn around. So you begrudgingly turn your ass around, and what's breathing up your asshole? Six foot xenomorph. Or a uh, necromorph? I think, it, I think they're called necromorphs. Because they're. They don't... They're not mutating aliens. They're mutated dead bodies. Like, it's this disgusting parasite that takes over and mutate, like... Grossly mutates them. In the most horrific fashion. Sh sham... Wow! Shh, 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 shh. I didn't need those nerves. Nope, nope, mm -mm, nope. I wasn't using them for anything. They're just, they just there. Excuse me. when you run you make noise you make a lot of noise like a, a ton of ton of noise can I close that door can I lock it like it's got power I should be able to lock that shit well that can't be good I mean they were sleeping at their desks quite literally oh shit oh shit 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 so if they started adding that, that means shit's about to hit the fan. You know what? What is that sound? Before we go any further. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah, I wanna override. You know when they start adding the hiding places. Shit is about to get the shittiest of shit kind of reels. Like, the reels nobody wants. Shit's about to start jumping and humping and pumping and... One of those damn Joe things. The working Joe synthetics are going to come out and eat my... F I don't want to play that. Ferris, it's Turner. Gotta deal with that wasted asshole again. This time he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. Wants to lock himself in. Screw him. We've got too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I threw him in this lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. What all these damn doors open automatically? Shouldn't you have had some kind of locks? Weights... Li weights lied to us. Uh, uh, I don't like the fact that there's water coming out of that. I 
do like the fact that she actually lifts up as she steps through the door. Because she's stepping on that dam. Uh, middle piece. Well, that's not promising. Nope. None of this. Oh, hey. Huh. Childhood. I'm gonna go near that. But I gotta go near that. I gotta see. I gotta see. <sighs> She's heading under that thing. That thing come out. I don't know why they keep randomly squeaking. I don't want to go in the vent. Don't make me go in the vent. Oh, they're going to make me go in the vent. They're going to make me go in the vent. Okay. Let no bad happen. Let no bad happen. I'm in the vent. Nothing good can come of that. Not a damn good thing. Making too much noise, girl. And again, I'm moving. And that's way too much damn noise. You guys do realize as soon as this stupid alien shows up, I'm gonna start dying a lot, right? Like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. It's a murder corridor door, a murder corridor door. Okay. Oh, do I gotta drop? Loud! It's gonna be loud as sin! <laughs> Take that. And I will. Maintenance Jack. I don't wanna pick up Maintenance Jack. Rulo, I wanna make a complaint to the, the highest authority, okay? My name is Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this. The fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. They put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking... It's so cold. I don't think this fucking thing even works. Yep. No. I think I need this more than you do. Yeah. Yeah, we do. Drop that. You set that thing down gently. Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? What purpose do you have doing that? Why does it feel like there's no other way to lock the damn door? Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just wanna know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. No? Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Maybe our friend here is just sure. What is 
is that? Okay, it's that thing that beeps. Yeah, see, I'm okay, perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Mm. Stay still. Damn okay. it. Okay. Now, turn around. Come on! Stop yelling. I'm Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley. Off station. A ship. There's no ships here. There are now. Well, <laughs> that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Yeah? Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. Okay. What's your name? Axel. Axel Foley? I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? By the blast? Because you seem to know your way around. Hit. I mean, why? What's in it for me? Okay. Place okay. on a ship. How do I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. What else you got to lose? This is your lucky day. Let's go, sweetheart. Seeks and comms is in the Sistex Bio. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble there, okay? Okay. I don't want to stick around here long. You gotta be quiet, you accented Is bastard. You following me back there? Had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. <sighs> Stick close to me. What? Hey, don't move. Uh, oh, okay, okay. We're not looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. They're just some assholes. We haven't got time for this. Come on, Jenna. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Uh huh. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. Really? Like, we could... <laughs> you guys don't realize this is a horror game. What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keeping to their own. Safer that way. No, it's not! Do you idiots not have horror movies in the future? Like, this is some grade A horror shit. This ship of yours is the real McCoy. Alright, guys, um, we ain't really got much left in this episode. Only about five six minutes and since this is the only way to save we're gonna call it right here i hope you guys have been enjoying the few episodes of uh alien isolation uh i will see you guys next time and hopefully i'll be a little less about everything bye